What's up guys? Welcome to another Transformers Friday. Today is a special treat. We are looking at my custom Titans Return Snapdragon. So the base mold for this was obviously Titans Return Brainstorm. As you can see, I've got it painted with Tester's acrylic paint. Let's see if I can get you in. Pretty good. There you go. All right. What I used for this was this gun is from a Titans Return breakaway or getaway. I have this accessory, which we'll get to in a minute. That's obviously from the Titans Return Crash Bash. We'll get to its functions in a little bit. And I use these from a knockoff Victory Leo. So, first things first, let's go through jet mode. Let's take our little Titan Master guy. He's all painted up, as you can see. There you go. Let's go with our jet mode first. So, obviously, transform same way that you would transform Brainstorm. So I'm doing this real quick. Like everybody else, I was pretty disappointed that Hasbro didn't come out with a Snapdragon and Ape Face. I mean, they had a perfect opportunity to come out with those guys and they never did. And I was a bit disappointed. We'll set that aside for now. So, after seeing some wonderful customs online, I decided that I would just make my own. Because that's what you do when you don't have the guys that you want. You just make your own. So here, that port is from the Titan's Return Nightbeat. And I'll get to its function when we get into Dragon Mode. He does have all three modes. I'm very proud of that. So, let's continue to transform up our guy here. We'll go around and flip these into place. Alright. And if you don't have Titan's Return Brainstorm, then this is a perfect opportunity to get a little bit of a review on it. So, it's not quite the same, but you know. Alright, and I, if you don't have Titans Return Brainstorm, I would recommend him. He is a fun figure. But, I'll get to that in another review. There we go. The wings weren't clipping in. There we go. Alright, so, I'm going to take my Titans Master here. Get that on camera. I'm going to go ahead, put that like this. Put him in there. Like so, I also do this. I put that as like a back seat and then put him in there. And it's a bit of a tight fit, a bit of a tight squeeze, but he does fit in there. So, there you are. There's the jet mode. All right, now I know what you're waiting for, so let's get to it. Let's put him in dragon mode. Okay, so once again, first thing you got to do, plug this guy up like that. Alright, so I was actually playing around with this one day, and I took the little Crash Bash Titan Master guy and put him on Brainstorm's legs, and I said, you know what? That actually looks pretty cool. I have an idea. So... I came up with this nonsense. All right. And what you do is, of course, you have to sort of mistransform Brainstorm here, or Snapdragon, as he is now called. You got to just just transform him and you have to use your imagination a little bit it's not perfect but you know I'm still pretty happy with it it's not just oh my god fantastic but it's it's still 
it's fun, it's functional, it works. And I apologize for if you're hearing the AC in the background. It was hot as crap today. Alright, we do that. We plug in our little Titan Master here. Fold these out. And you have Snapdragon in his dinosaur mode. And like I said, it's it's not perfect. It's not fantastic. You have to use your imagination a little bit. But it works. I'm pretty happy with it. Get a little bit closer shot. There you go. There you go. One of those things of just you know, being bound and determined. I couldn't figure out how to get the dragon arms there for the longest time. But my wife, being awesome as she is, kept encouraging me and, you know, being supportive, so that was nice. Uh, in this mode, he's got, you know, some dragon legs. he got the elbows from the arm. The dragon arms just kind of go back and forth. And he's got a little bit of a head articulation. So that's pretty cool. But... I hope you guys like this. Uh, it's just a custom that I wanted to show off. Like I said, it's not perfect, but it was pretty fun to make, and I'm very proud of it. So, all right, guys. As always, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.